Hey there everybody, it's Mike Delisio with another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing. And today, we're going to be taking a look at the Role Player Friends and Familiars expansion, but we're also going to be looking at the big box that it is contained within uh, that allows you to put in all of the components from the base Role Player and the first expansion along with this Friends and Familiars expansion. So it's kind of a storage solution slash look at the new expansion. You can see it is, let's see, you know if you can make out on camera, this is embossed, it's raised in the corners here, and the title, very nice box. Here's the rule book for the friends and familiars. Take a quick flip through that. So we've got our familiar board, some new dice, combat dice, split dice, different types of cards. Goes into the setup of the game, the play sequence. This only lists the changes for the friends and familiars. And the solo rules for that as well, along with the reference. Okay, so it looks like we've got some new characters here. We've got Shecky. Let me get that so you can see it on camera. Okay. And we've got Saurion, Vargar, oops, I think I missed one there, Kalika, or Kaika, I don't think there's an L there, Kaika, perhaps, may not be doing the pronunciation justice, and then we've got our familiars, the Horned Viper, the Screech Owl, the Ice Bear, Shadow Drake, the Flame Imp, the Nalos Leopard, Long Tailed Weasel, Silver Warthog, Drogul Wolf, the Scorch Phoenix, the Tempest Fox, and the Jackalope, the Cursed Raven, Ancient Tortoise, Blood Badger, and they all have different abilities too. Uh, Haunted, time-worn, tough. Looks like a place for fiends over here. And now I believe, yes, I think I was calling it the friends and familiars. It's the fiends and familiars. Fiends are no friends. Here we can see our kind of marbled D6s. Take a look at some of these custom D6s here. Engraved. There we go, some nice engraved dice there. And I'm struggling to get back in the bag, so I'm not gonna mess with it. We've got our acrylic kind of ice blue cubes there. Let's take a look at some of the cards. Looks like we've got some items here for the market. Flip through some of these. Part of a mystic set. A runic set and scrolls, skills, traits, weapons, all things that should be familiar if you've played role player, especially if you incorporate any of the uh, expansion material within. Just kind of giving you a quick look, and there's our turn order cards. All right, so here we can see some of the different classes. Centurion, Hunter, Beastmaster, Scribe, Outrider, Conjurer. Just going through these quickly. Here are some minions. Bat Swarm. Look nasty. All right, look at some of the big cards here. These are monsters. Of 
Got our Cyclops. Woo! Bloodthirsty Cyclops. Gorgon. Griffin. Hydra. Leviathan. Megapede. And then we've got some player aid cards. All right, and then lastly, we'll just look at really quickly at some of these small attack cards from the different monsters. There we go. Marauders. Quicksand. All right, Deceiver, Desperation. Purist, Difficult Terrain. So you can see there's a number of these smaller cards of different types. All right, well, I think that gives you a pretty good idea of what you'll find inside the large box of role player, focusing primarily on the Fiends and Familiars expansion. Thank you for watching another Dice Tower Daily Unboxing.